So today I want to tell you how important it is to get inspired. Don't sit around waiting to get inspired. Don't sit around and wait for inspiration to hit. You have to make yourself inspired. So a lot of people sit around waiting for inspiration to hit. You know, they sit around and waiting for that motivation to do what they want to do. But you got to realize inspiration is something you create. You create inspiration by going out there and making it happen. Same comes for motivation. I mean, have you ever noticed how you sit around at home and suddenly a piece of music comes on and you get inspired and stuff like that? Well, you know, the music, put on some music and get inspired. Uh, go, if you want to go running, go to a running track like this and you'll get inspired just by right now there's lots of kids here playing and playing football and stuff and that's that's cool that's inspirational too you know being around sports if you want to go running when I come here to the running track and I go running here I get so inspired just by seeing the tracks the red color the whole setting just inspires me so I I don't sit around at home and wait to like oh I wish I could I was inspired to run. no I just go out there and I create the inspiration that I need to do what I want to do so I come here and I find inspiration instantly same is true you know if you want to lift weights or if you want to do some something like that uh, you might be able to find inspiration just uh, hanging out in trees and stuff around your house and that's cool Personally, I find that I'm much more inspired to work out when I go to a gym or if I go to a kind of calisthenics area because once I'm there in the gym, you know, there's other people working out. The whole atmosphere is about, you know, uh, building muscle, building a special physique and um, having fun and playing. Go to the calisthenics park, people are hanging upside down, you know, swinging with their arms and it's like, it's just inspirational to be around other people doing the same thing same comes for studying and stuff like that you know if you want to study something and you're not going to school well you might want to go to school just to get into that mindset just to get into that environment of learning that's what I would say is the most valuable thing about going to school not necessarily what you learn because you could learn that on your own by reading books and watching YouTube videos but by being at a school you're surrounded by other people learning and the whole environment is about learning and that puts you in the right mindset so if I want to learn something real good I usually go to the library and I sit down and I study I make a couple of hours of like study time same comes for working making YouTube videos I sit down and this is my you know a lot of time for working and then I get into that mindset so what is my point in this video my point is you create the life you want don't sit around waiting for it to happen and be like oh, everything is just you know being like a victim of your circumstances no you can change the circumstances you can create the circumstances necessary for you to be motivated so it's all about getting yourself motivated getting yourself inspired by seeking out the right books seeking out the right YouTube videos seeking out the right environment for growth going to the running track going to the gym going to the calisthenics park going to the library, going to school, getting out in nature, you know, if you want to get immerse yourself in nature and be like meditating and calm yourself, whatever, go out in nature, you know, seek out the environment necessary for your growth. Don't be afraid to be a beginner either, you know, going to the gym and, you know, I'm, I'm pretty much a beginner when it comes to lifting weights and stuff like that. I'm just starting out, I'm having fun with it, uh, but don't be afraid to sit down and lift, you know, a light weight. Everyone's lifting heavy weights, but you're just lifting light weights. Well, that's okay, you know, don't be afraid to be a beginner. Don't be afraid to fail. Failure is the stepping stone to success. Success is just a series of failures. And then finally you succeed. And actually, if you think about it, it's training and stuff like that. It's all about training to failure, making your muscle fail. At that point, you will experience the most amount of growth. All right, so go out there, find your environment, for growth put yourself in the mindset and the atmosphere you need to reach your goals go at it and fail 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 until you succeed you'll get there no matter what this is a law of nature always see you around